Hello Ants! Today I'm going to be creating a new farm account. What I've done off camera is that I've created an extra Google account um, and I have that linked on my phone. What you need to do to create a new farm account is like this. You click on your power right in the center, right over here. You can see your name, um, uh, you click on settings, you can see your account, this one over here, click on account. First step first, make sure that yours is a bound account so that you can get back into the game, into your main account and that you don't lose all your progress. So today we are going to start a new game and create a new farm and bring it to my zone. So here we go. New game. Okay. So the game loads again. And it's a it's a tutorial, it's a documentary, and we shall skip that. Okay. So the tutorial starts off um, very linear. You just double click where it tells you to click. You build roads where it tells you to build roads, tunnels, and uh, we just follow through. Chapter one. And you play. Leaf cutter. More tunnels. Construction. Plant flora. Supply the leaf cutter. After a while, you get very familiar with this fungus. They want you to just click the diamond. Chapter one done. And we take off more soil. And we get attacked. Okay, we put the Guardian Barracks. For farms, the Guardian Barracks, Shooter Barracks, and uh, Carrier Barracks. Speed up. Um, they need to be placed. Because the tutorial forces you to, but you don't need to level them. Okay, track dealt with. Thank you for the diamonds. 
Same with the sentinel tree. You can build it, but you don't need to level it. No need to use it. Okay, claim some rewards. And get on with the next chapter. Hunger. Okay, this is chapter 3. This is when you can actually see the chat box up here and you have your inventory box here. But I can't click on it yet. Okay, it's railroading me down. Can I get out of this here? Okay, lovely. So after placing the woodlouse colony, um, uh, I have the ability to click on my power here. I also have the ability to open up the chat and open up the inventory, which is important because this is where you go to change your zones. So from the inventory, um, uh, you have some diamonds, the ones that you just, uh, the game just gave you, some speed ups, and uh, under buffs, this is where you will find um, uh, the newbie teleport. They give you two in fact. Um, uh, you can use it three days after registering and before reaching level five. So between, after chapter three, uh, but before you get to queen level 5, you can use this to go to any zone you like. So I'm going to use this. Um, the new account goes into server, into the most recently registered server. Um, or maybe not. I think these are servers that are prepped but they are not feeding accounts into yet, the higher up ones. Alright, but I am going to bring my account to my server, which is number 47. Alright, so that brings me... to my server. If you do make a mistake, you have another one that you can use to go somewhere else all right but once you level past um, your queen level 5 you can no longer change your zones um, so from here you continue building um, your farm or if you are building a new account um, this is how you register a new account into a zone of your choice Thank you very much for watching. Oh, sorry. Before we go, please remember to bind your account. Click on the power. Click on settings. Click on the account. It is unbound. And what you want to do is bind your account so you can swap between your farm and your main account. So bind your account, remember to bind your account, otherwise the work that you have put in into building your farm will be wasted. Thank you very much for watching. Um, uh, in the next video, I will show you, um, I'll bring you through how I actually built the farms through um, the tutorial you get from uh, a level 2 queen here all the way to level 8 in a fairly short amount of time use those speed ups all right thank you very much for watching and have a good day